Welcome, my name is Elijah. And I'm Michelle. And, and this, this is, is Fun Possible. Possible. Disneyland and the first thing that we're doing is we're meeting Moana and I've been trying to do this for the last month or so so I'm super excited and it just so happens to be on the day that I have my Moana and Maui ears on and my Moana shirt and my heart of Tafiti so I might cry. <laughs> jokes are kind of crummy. Anyways, up ahead here now, look at this, everybody. Wow, if you're taking any photos, go right ahead and do so. They're wearing their trunks today. Wow, what a fun fact for you folks about elephants. Most baby elephants, they can grow up to four feet. Most baby humans, they can only grow two. So who knew that, right? That's pretty amazing. Oh, great, because you think into my car and then the lights on. I'll never get it to turn over tomorrow. 
You know what? This place is bananas. We're gonna split. Keep your eyes peeled though, okay? It's very important. Let me know if you want to hear another one though, because I've got a bunch. Inside there, that's the African bull elephant, one of the largest, one of the most feared creatures in all the jungle. However, the most feared, the most dangerous creature on the planet is right here on the right hand side. It's his mother in law. And yeah. watch out for the mother in law, it's very dangerous, very scary, so you can understand. The long ones on the back up there at the next of the giraffes. These ones over here off to the right are the brown ones. Yeah. Oh, look at this, everybody. This is a pride of lions defending a sleeping zebra. Aww, Aww how sweet is that? Yeah, you know what? The zebra's probably just dead tired from the game of tag that they were playing earlier. We're going to let him rest in peace, though, okay? Oh, look at this. See, this is why you never get into an argument with a the rhino. They're very good at getting their points across. brunch at the Queen Mary tomorrow and then next weekend we're gonna show you guys the Mother's Day special tea that they're having at the Disneyland Hotel so her um, her present is kind of delayed just by a week but we're gonna take her to the special Mother's Day tea at the Disneyland Hotel so I hope you guys will tune in and watch that one thanks Hello. so I think it's time for us to head back to our hotel get a little Excuse nap me. in uh, one of the benefits I don't think that we talked about this before uh, but one of the benefits of staying at a hotel that is near property, we don't stay on property, but near property, you get to walk to the hotel, take a little nap, 
midday, come back at night, be refreshed. You know, stay till midnight. And stay till midnight. Yeah, don't rush it. Just stay a little, you know, take a little break, come back later, stay a little bit later, and you can get on a few more rides. That's usually the, the sweet time to get your rides in. Hey guys, so we are back in the parks. Here's Michelle. We're back in the parks over at DCA, uh, getting a few things in here before the park closes. We're gonna look at uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, how it looks all lit up. They just started lighting it up. about you guys but I am really excited about this this looks great all lit up amazing now I'll always miss Tower of Terror because they took it out but it's kind of nice having something different it's what so amazing I'm excited now right all lit up and changed it's really cool well but I love Guardians I don't care what anybody says um, it's gonna be amazing. Like I was saying, it's it'll be nice to have something different, something that the other parks yes. don't have. And Walt Disney World, Hollywood Studios will still have Tower, a Tower of Terror, so it'll be okay. And most people don't remember that old Disney Channel movie that it came from, right? Right. Do you? What? Remember that movie? There was a movie on the Disney Channel for Tower of Terror. I just thought that it came from Twilight Zone. Well, it did, but there was also a movie on the Disney Channel that went with it. No idea. Oh. Well, you learned I'm looking you. outside my window. I try to see where my luck goes. I just don't know how. He's so dreamy. <laughs> Can't wait to see his booty get kicked by, what's his name? Cruise something. The mirrors? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just trying to start some drama in Cars Land. Oh, it's lit up. There must be some kind of plan. Every person could be you, though. A pretty guy with a halo. But who am I kidding? Now, I gotta realize that you, you, you some ribs but we're eating it in one of our favorite places to eat which is right here outside and we can see uh, what is the name of it it's radiator springs racers radiator springs racers but what is the name of, of this place in the Ornament movie mm, that was good now i'm sleepy why is Babe, this not you have ribs on your face i got ribs on my face Slimy, yet satisfying. <laughs> oh wait, still there. So an amazing thing happened, and right over here, Dave Coulier walked by. Every now and then something like that happens. What? Dave Coulier. Oh yeah. Cut it out. Yep, I'm the only one who figured out who it was. I knew who it was after I saw who it was. It's because I used to watch Full House every night. Not to brag, With but. My grandma. And we watched it. Yeah. <laughs> that makes us different than all the Americans our age. I just don't know how. 
best to bring a mother with you on Mother's Day. Absolutely. They don't hand them out. No, they're not for free. This is my first time on the Queen Mary and it is, it's really nice. It's cool. I'm thinking that we need to do uh, maybe a cruise some point because th that's amazing in there. Yeah. And uh, we'll take a little trip around the Queen Mary, show you our brunch. Uh, you can go on tours. We might do a tour later on. So We'll, we'll see, but this is an amazing ship. I want to do you're... the haunted tour and see all the ghosts. It's supposed, supposed to be really haunted. Maybe not today, but uh, at one point. Tour prices are around $30 if you want to go on any of the tours around the ship. I'm not sure how much it costs to stay here, but you can always look that up. Yes, you know, you there's can, a hotel in here also. There's a hotel. And they do uh, haunted things during uh, Halloween. They do uh, different things during the holidays. They have a Christmas celebration, yeah. too. So definitely check it out. They bring snow to California because we don't get that here. If you come out to uh, Southern California for Disneyland and you want to check out a few other the attractions in Southern California, I think this is this is a must. And we're really close. We're only about 30 minutes from Disneyland. It's just more towards the coast than Disneyland is. And also right down the street from here is the Long Beach Aquarium, which is one of our other very very favorite places mm -hmm. to visit. If you've never been there, it's awesome. They have my favorite animal. And you can take cruises around the harbor uh, from the same area as the Long Beach. Um, the Aquarium of the Pacific. It's terrific. <laughs> history. on this ship. I am um, obsessed with ghosts. I really want to go on the ghost tour. If we, we might go after brunch. Maybe. It's a maybe. If not, then we'll We're definitely, definitely come, back. come back. The one that you can do after brunch though is the shortened one. There's actually one that they do only at nighttime and it's called Paranormal Investigations. That sounds fun. That sounds like right up my alley. 
I love everything scary and paranormal and I'm obsessed with ghost stories. I forced my mother to take me to the Winchester Mystery House in San Jose so that we could try and see ghosts. We didn't see any though. How old is this ship? Uh, is it from the 1930s? Based on the smell, the historic smell. The historic smell tells me it's from the 20s. No? I don't know. I don't know. Let's fact oh, check it. Oh, I thought it. you knew the answer. <laughs> no idea. I mean, they have a lot of black and white photographs that look, of people on the Queen Mary that look 20s it's, and 30s-ish. Yeah, the photos around here that they have on the walls definitely look like they're old people. I mean, <laughs> that, that's like, look how old that guy looks. Definitely historic. Definitely historic. See how historic that guy looks? Lifeboat demonstration. Now, we kind of want to go down here. If you've seen the big, I don't know, you probably can't see it out of the window. It's a little too bright out there, but I'll show you in just a second here. Where they used to have the spruce goose, and I was really excited about this. But it moved it way back in 1993, so they don't have it there anymore. But they had the spruce goose, and it was in this big dome over here. But now, it is a port for the Carnation Cruises. So you see this big dome had the Spruce Goose in there. So Howard Hughes built a Hercules that was nicknamed the Spruce Goose. Big failure, but it only flew like a little bit, but I'm really into aviation, if you didn't know. But if you look back here, look at that. Carnival Cruises and my wife. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really nice day out and they do have weddings while we were walking uh, they pa we passed by the uh, wedding area where they have like a gazebo up here so really neat good stuff over here out on the deck we get to look around a little bit um, we're right by the port of LA yeah I'm not sure if we're gonna go up the stairs right now no. Uh, we're, it's about time for our brunch, so we're gonna go down Ooh. and eat. It's kind of breezy. A little bit of a breeze, but Don't I like it. Don't wear a skirt on the Queen Mary. I like it. <laughs> the breeze. Look at, don't is. those things right there look like at ats from um, Star Wars? They do. Are they supposed to? Well, it, those are shipping container movers so that the containers can be taken off of a ship then put onto semis or trains and then moved. Uh, that is actually how George Lucas came up with the idea. Not this one, not here, but oh. while looking at those movers at, I forget which port it was, uh, huh. he ended up coming up with the idea nice. of what if those were giant mechanica, mechanical Animals. War machines that were coming in, and that's how I came up with the ADAT -AT, or ATAT, yeah. -AT, however you want to talk. Want to? People actually say ATAT. -AT. Some people say ATAT. -AT. I've never <gasps> heard that. What? I'm sorry, guys. Historical steps. More of them. Do they smell old? It smells so old. It smells so old. <laughs> All right. I guess we better go find the mother and so the can... father. Specifically, the mother. We Just, brought our own. We brought our we own. We don't want anyone to steal her. They don't give them out for free. They do not give them out for free. So, <laughs> let's go and find the mother so the we can... The historical heir choked me. <laughs> So that's going to do it for our Mother's Day weekend. Ooh, I'm so tired because <laughs> I ate too much food. The food was really good. There was a lot of it and the decor was amazing. I felt like Leonardo DiCaprio was going to come out any minute and maybe, um, what's her name? 
Kate Winslet. I was gonna call her Rose. <laughs> That's her name. It's I think. Yes, and Rose. And Rose. Yeah, Jack was gonna come out. Yeah. Paint me like one of his French girls and. Ugh. It was so pretty in there though to see the original decor and everything is made of what did dad say it was tigers tiger striped mahogany yeah special kind of wood that they special used a lot wood, historic wood they used it a lot in the early 1900s <laughs> don't make fun of me so thank you for joining us for mother's day weekend we hope that you had a great mother's day weekend as well with your mother or if you're a mother yourself Happy Mother's or Day. Or just a mother of fur animals. Yeah. Or a, a stepmom. Or, I don't know, a <laughs> mom to your husband. <laughs> mm-hmm. So thank you for watching. Uh, you can find us on Facebook at... Fun Possible. And on Instagram at... Fun Possible. And sometimes you can find us on Snapchat at... <laughs> Fun Possible. Remember, if you can dream it... You can do it. <laughs>